Hey, so I am going to do something a little different today. Instead of playing video games or reacting to anime, I'm going to react to Iron Within, which is on Warhammer TV. I can't wait to see if I have to edit this or how exactly copyright will work with this. I'm going to... So based on some other people's reactions of um, like Angels of Death and stuff, I'm going to post the entire thing and see how it goes. So wish me luck with that. But you know, I figured I have I have Warhammer Plus. I always buy it just to get the miniature, so might as well use it. I will warn you, I'm probably going to watch a lot from Warhammer Plus. I've already watched, well of course I've watched Astartes, and I've watched Angels of Death and some Hammer and Bolter, but other than that, I haven't really watched anything from here. So, but we're starting off with Iron Within, mainly because... <laughs> One of the largest armies that I currently collect is Iron Warriors. And I know Iron... Come on. Iron Warriors are clearly in this one. <laughs> if they weren't, I'd be disappointed. So, simply because of that fact, I am going to do it. You know what? Even, I'll even show you some pictures since Iron Warriors are my favorite faction. Probably. Other than the Imperial Guard. Iron Warriors are my favorite to start this faction. They're just interesting. I have... Chaos Space Marines version of them, 40k, and also a Horus Heresy army. So, you know, very excited to see how they're portrayed in this animation that was made by um, GW themselves. Let's get right into this. There we are. There we go. Okay, here we are. Yeah, I should really watch more Warhammer TV. I do pay like $60 a year for it, even though I justify it just as the miniature. Speaking of, it's a Kazarkin this year, or I guess a vampire, but I'm not getting that one. I love the fact that uh, Iron Warriors and Astra Militarum are my two big armies. So, I haven't read anything. I should have read the synopsis, honestly, before going into this. Looks like... Are they sieging a world already? No, that's Elk. That's Dark Elk. Oh. That's Dark Elk. Huh? An Imperial Guard? Yep. Ooh, Cadians. Maybe. Nah, no, they're Cadians. They're definitely. Okay, looks like we're starting off with the battle between Cadians and, um... Dark Eldar. Jukari. Jeez. Yeah, dudes, you aren't gonna have good luck with that one. Did he just... <laughs> it's such a Dark Eldar thing to do, isn't it? Even in the Grim Dark Future, there's melee combat. Yo, maybe, Guard, you should shoot at him while he's, like, just standing still. Oh, she actually hit him. That's actually surprising. I bet you if he was on foot, he'd have a better time dodging. Oh, what is it? Is it going to be... What are they called? What's their infantry called? Cabalite Warriors? You know, surprisingly, despite them being really busted last edition, no one at my local uh, store plays Drakari, so I don't really know much about them. Load on to the Chimera. Wait, where's the Commissar? Shouldn't he be like, Guardsmen, fight to the death. I guess their Commissar isn't with them. Cowards. Someone needs to get the Commissar for these guys. Oh no, he got left behind alive. Ooh. man. Okay, I wonder how the Iron Warriors are going to roll into this. I swear to God, if there's not Iron Warriors, I'm going to bash my head against the wall. <laughs> Ooh, what is... Oh, that's a... Are fleeing into the city. The Xenos come every night. He must be the guard commander. And they fade into daylight. Ooh. 
get closer. So basically, they're just doing terror tactics. They have no objective that we can discern besides terror and taking prisoners, civilian prisoners. Ah! It's, it's all wrong, all wrong. There's no need to die. Yes, yes, no need. They can take what they want from the streets. We Dude. Can pull our forces back. Give them free reign. I'm guessing that's the planetary governor. A gesture, really. Bro, for them to come you don't. Closer. A small price to pay. You don't no negotiate to come any with the El Dark Eldar. Duty is to protect this world and its um, citizens for the Emperor. I mean, for the Emperor. No price they see not demand. None, Governor. All is lost. Speak it. Speak the truth. <laughs> not. Oh no. Is the ancient protocol, Lord Governor. Is this guy secretly a recognition of the tide of our sons in days of old? We may call upon the angels of death. Oh, they're a recruitment world? They shall answer. Myths and childish fantasies. There are no angels to save us, fool. That's that's a Eye of Horus staff. A ship. Yes, a ship. They're part of the Imperium, uh, right? Vessels in orbit. Just one. A they must be. They have Imperium gear. Far away. Hmm. There are none. The merchants have long since fled, and our warships are drifting wreckage by now. Oh, jeez. Let me guess. They're at the outer perimeter or something. Commander, Governor, we have pulled all surviving units back to the palace precincts. Yep. We're trying to get everyone we can inside the walls. But the enemy is everywhere. Classic, is classic this? Dark Eldar. What drawing it out, drawing this? out the suffering. <laughs> I have ordered your citizens protected by whatever means and strength we have. Oh, oh, no, no, no. You had no right. Yeah, he does. He's a guard officer. The majesty of the Imperium. I am the Emperor's anointed ruler. Oh, they must be PDF. They're not actual guard. There is no way out now. I thought I'd already given them enough. I, I thought. Oh no! Traitor, heretic, they would make him go scum. That I could be governor in his Do your duty. They would not take anything. End him. Oh, scumbag. It was you. Literally. You gave your people to the Xenos. <laughs> Traitor. I was of a few peasants. I was born to rule this world. This is treason, Commander. You're the you traitor. Swore an oath to me. He swore an oath to the Imperium, to the God Emperor of mankind, not to you. Oh damn, he actually did it. Hell yeah. Oh, she did it. He swore ah! an oath to the Emperor. We both did. For the Emperor. <laughs> so other than the acting being a little over the top so far, it's pretty good and entertaining. What now? The rituals of calling. No, dude, don't trust this man. No, don't trust him. We must trust ourselves. Wait a second. Can I... Commander, I pause. So, from what I'm gathering, they have a myth that they used to give son their sons to an Astartes chapter, clearly. There. Hmm. But that dude has an eye of Horus, and are they going to call it... Are they a recruit of like a former recruiting world? No, because they probably would have gotten destroyed in the scouring if that was the case. Let's just watch. The manufacturer of Primus. Call on the angels. I want to watch this entire thing, and then no pausing, and then just get my here's my reaction, and then I'll do and have some words after. I think yeah, I think that's how I'm gonna do that. <laughs> because I'm sure if I keep on watching, because this is just one episode thing, I'm pretty sure. Oh, what are those called? Ugh, I don't know. I don't. I never play against Dark Elder. 
I don't know most of their units' names. It's like their transport ship, though. I can't tell- I don't think these guys are Cadians, I think they're PDF. No concealment. No attempt to hide that they're coming. Of course, they want you to- Exactly, they want the fear. First attack. Instead, they return every night, cutting a little further through our defenses, drawing this out. Yep. Why? Why are they doing this? Because your suffering pleases them. What is afraid? They seem to relish our terror almost as much as our blood. <laughs> Let them choke on it. Better to die than submit. Mm. Better still to win and live. Dude, I like how he just literally has a fucking you <laughs> an eye. <laughs> ah. He just doesn't look trustworthy. No answer has come from the sea of souls. Oh, so he must be an astropath, clearly. Right, that's what they're called. Yeah, navigators of the ships. I must rest. Send it again. Keep on doing it until you die or they die. <laughs> Must look to the iron within. They will come. You hear that? They oh my god. They totally are a recruitment world for iron warriors. Pro <gasps> they are promised to return. Ah! Our blood is their blood. Oh my god. The, of angels. the red they shall come. They don't know. They don't know that the iron warrior they probably just don't know. They probably think it's an actual loyalist chapter that they are they don't know. It's probably been so long since they've been a recruitment world. Oh my god. <laughs> they don't remember who, just who they gave their sons to. Permission to detonate the mines. Oh. <gasps> that means the Iron Warriors are going to answer them and come. Oh my god. It's probably not good for these defenders, though. Ha <laughs> Iron within. I don't know how well that would work, you know, with them being on floating boats. Oh, I guess just that. Yeah, direct impacts. Ambush them. Fight scenes are also a little meh in this, I think. You know? Doesn't really have the punch, or... As I was talking about, no punch. I don't know, it just seems a little like, I don't know. Meh. It's definitely passable, you know, serviceable. Oh shit. <laughs> They're fucked. Those things can kill the Stardies. They're doomed. The Emperor protects those who fight. Up! Get firing! The Emperor protect... Clearly. Clearly he was, should have been fighting, coward. The Emperor does not protect you, then. Oh man, dude, these... I guess they've been slowly getting, you know, crushed little by little, so it makes sense. I guess the El Dark Eldar are just like, yep, it's over. I wonder how the Iron Warriors are gonna like, like what, I um, Thunder, what are they called, Thunderhawk Assault? Like, you know, drop in low orbit, then drop off the troops? Oh, dang. Drop pot assault! Oh my god. <laughs> but wait, they don't have drop pods unless there's. <gasps> They're dead. 
Dreadclaw, uh, drop pod assault. Oh my god. No, you guys are doomed. You think you're all good now, but you guys are... <laughs> this is so much worse. I don't know. I think it's just they're doomed. It's not like it's worse or... Uh... Oh, those bolters. If only they had, like, more... <clears throat> sound. This would be perfect. Oh, I wonder how long it's gonna take for the for the PDF to realize that they're doomed. There he is. You know, see a space room with those with those little points on his armor? And trimming? Probably not good. Oh my god, that looks so it's a Terminator! Oh my god. Don't, don't tell me it ends there. Oh thank god. <gasps> Preachers! Oh my god. That should be a unit. That should be a Chaos Space Marine unit. <laughs> the angels came. I knew. I'm gonna definitely show a picture of my in in production breachers because I'm currently building them. Oh my god. Hmm. Oh, that's a Chaos Loaded Terminator armor, isn't it? He's just leaving all the... Br ah, that's funny. He's in the middle of the shield wall because the Terminator arm armor itself is a shield. Yeah, see, this is what I mean. The combat kind of meh. Sound effects for the gunfire, meh. Otherwise, I can kind of respect that. Are they just going to do a, like, grinding advance? Oh my god. Ah. Glory to the fourth. <laughs> ah. Oh my god, this is so... <laughs> I'm fanboying right now. Ah. Uh. Where they start realize, bro, what are you doing? Oh, you're dead. <laughs> Making a quilla right in front of him. Oh, at least she knows right away. Yeah, no, these are these are bad omens. Sure, they're gonna help you kill all the Eldar, but you might not be alive at the end. I wish they had a better sound effect for the bolter. So much. <laughs> also, another thing, the Eldar... They're moving way too slow, if that makes sense. Eldar are known for being fast. Like, lightning quick. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Man. Is that a... Is that a Graviton Mace, or is that supposed to be a Power Mace? A Power Maul? We need to fall back now or while I think that was a Graviton Maul. Like a... What's it called? Graviton Crusher? Compared to being an actual Power Weapon, since Power Weapons are like lightning... Sparking. Or that was like more... Yeah. Oh my god. Oh, this is so amazing. This makes me want to buy the, um, the new Mark IV, or the Mark III armor that they revealed. I'd have to customize it because I don't really like the aesthetics of it, but, yeah. I like the aesthetics of Mark III, just not the redesign they did. Oh my god, they're literally just murdering. They're checking the box. That was so good. Oh, you guys are doomed. Is that the, uh, what are they called? What are Dark Eldar leaders called? Captains? Um, Ar Archon? Maybe? I don't know. Is this yours? 
I found oh. this cowering here. Oh, I see it now. You hoped to use its feeble mind to call for help. Oh, they did call for help. <laughs> oh, shit. Hmm. Screams. Xenos screams. Death is coming for you, you twisted bastard. Go and see. Turn it around, being like, F you, Xenos, we might die, but you're gonna die with us. Planning to keep this to keep harvesting, aren't they? Oh man. Even Dark Eldar are messed up. <laughs> squad with him of course probably the veterans like the vet cream of the crop veterans He's not going to kill them here, though. Comes the harvest and the feast of pain. Bro. Defiant even now. Why are you trying? You will be a gift to the arenas. Hmm. Useless cattle. Do you oh, even see. know what you have summoned? Are you so short-lived that you forget even the monsters of your own past? <laughs> yes, they do. The Iron Warriors turned their backs on your Emperor long ago. It is the power of mm. chaos that now flows in their veins. Then we'll die together. Stupid <laughs> flesh puppet. You shall hang from the razor rack. Until I tire from your screams. Only then I will bid the homunculi to make a writhing ornament of you for my throne room. Oh, jeez. Oh, I don't think you're going to live long enough for that. Ooh. The Chaos Lord's going to fight him. Oh, that's going to be cool. It's going to be like, yep. You shall never know the release of death. That is such. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. That sounds about that, right? Oh, dude, they just breached through the side of her room. Hell yes. Oh. Dang. Stardies are built different, of course. I'm gonna assume the Archons probably, or whatever he's called, is gonna kill a few. Yep. Yeah, like I was saying, fight scenes are kind of... Eh. What does he have? He has, like, one of those shadow barriers that, like, you know, hold out until they don't. Right? <laughs> Just keep on loading, boys. <laughs> the Stardust did that exact same, same scene, but better. Ah! Oh, is she gonna? Yes. Oh, that's unfortunate.
Oh, he has a power fist. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this this probably yeah, this anime <laughs> this anime <laughs> this anime uh, I can't even I'm sorry that was so funny that he how that ended this, <laughs> this probably upset a few Dark Elder players didn't it. Oh no, he's good. They're, they're dead. Uh, I wonder when this takes place. Like, time lies wise. If it's after the Great Rift, when when they actually did start taking over worlds. Weakness is a choice. Ha! <laughs> that is. Yeah, that's pretty spot on. If anyone's curious about what this is, they should watch um, Iron Within Warrior Tier. That. Oh my god. Amazing. Iron Warriors, like I said, my favorite faction. <laughs> we must protect the survivors. The people must be led. Little did you know, you're probably gonna. Ah. Nah, dude. That's not. I will not kneel. Better to die. And to submit. So you shall have the judgment of iron. Oh, they're fortifying it, I'm guessing. <laughs> that armor. Man. A lot of Mark II is what I noticed. A lot of Mark II armor in this. saw that coming. Oh, did they promote her to... Oh, interesting. They promoted her because she was defiant. Wow, man. Jeez. You know, what I have to say about that is that was pretty good. I mean, there definitely was flaws with it. I will say that the actual, like, fight scenes that they had, no. Those were meh. The, uh, the sound effects for some of the weapons was meh. Overall, it looked nice. Dude, I wouldn't say it's 10 out of 10. Like, Astartes is like, oh. That is like, oh. <laughs> the cream of the crop when it comes to Warhammer animations. But I will say, that was, uh, overall pretty good. I, like I was saying before, when I was <laughs> laughing so much about the animation, um... This probably upset Dark Eldar players, not gonna lie. I feel like uh, it does a little bit of a disservice to them, but you know. Dark, El Dark Eldar and the lore are... Yeah. But, I don't care because I'm an Iron Warrior fanboy. If it has anything to do with the Astra Militarum, the, Gar <laughs> the um, Iron Warriors, or World Leaders, you can count me in on that one. Um... I don't know. I think that's about all I have to say about this. With that being say, said, please let me know what you think in the comments. 
I'm curious to see what you all think about this animation as well. And with that, thank you so much, and goodbye. Hey, also, what do you want me to watch next on Warhammer Plus? Like I said, I've watched everything. Well, no, not everything. I haven't watched anything other than Angels of Death, Astartes, and some of the um, Hammer and Bolt Gun. Bolt Gun and Hammer. Whatever it's called. So, yeah.